Well, I hope you've had a chance to take a look at a lot of the clouds uh, lately. Uh, these are really beautiful. Uh, again, like we talked about in an earlier video, and you guys did a great job in class. Uh, start with a dark blue. Actually, start with a really light blue through here, let it fade to nothing, you know, to, to down to here, very light. Throw in some dark blue, maybe a little purple, and you have that dark to light. Again, not touching anything in here, which or otherwise where they're, where you want your clouds. Then you flip it upside down and put a little dark at the base. And take a look at the clouds around us today. It's really fascinating. So I thought just to finish this week off and finish this off, I'd throw a little uh, some trees. I'd t I could have done a little lighter, but these are just sort of some light background sort of trees or some foliage. And then I'm going to go back to, this was one of our original. I did this back in the day when we first started, uh, you know, how to do trees. So I'm going to start with the lighter lights first and then end with the dark, dark part. But this is sort of an impression. I'm not trying to get every leaf, obviously. But uh, we'll see how this works. So I'm going to mix a little bit of my brown with the green. This brown over here, maybe this brown with the green to get to get an olive. I want kind of a nice olive color, not really a lot of harsh um, green to it. So we mix these two together. Actually, I'm going to maybe then mix it with the water, add a little more orange. Again, a lot of water. And we'll put this down as some of the lighter part of it. So we'll put this, we're going to make this a little bigger towards the front here. And again, we're just going to mix it in a little bit like this. We'll be interested to see if this actually covers up some of the background. Kind of dab it in through here. Maybe put one over here. A little more. A little bit of brown. Again, a little bit of water. Let it puddle. We'll let this dry. Then we make it start making a little bit darker. Not worried about this, the uh, tree trunks yet. Just gonna wait to see how this, this all works out. Then we can put a little bit of some tree trunks. Again, you're thinking with the tree trunk, you're thinking thin, you know, thin lines like this. See that? Real thin lines. Maybe some water with the with the brown for the back ones. So the ones in the background will be a little bit lighter. A little bit of a forest look to it. Okay. Then the base, again, we got the, the light coming from the left here. Oop. Let's see, make sure those aren't, Oop. get some of those. I got a couple of spots here, green. Let me just water those out. I don't, a little too much green up there. Got a little messy. I'm gonna add a little purple to my, my base now. And that's gonna be my dark. And I, got, I see sort of a shadow going this way. I'm gonna kind of go down like this. So just maybe a little bit like this. A little light in the background. Okay. Yeah, so the idea is I got my darker trees here, and there's a little bit of some. There we go. And then maybe a little bit of some light 
light uh, brown there's little dots in here like there's, if there's some grass or some and again I'm, I'm just just going to focus here in the center let it just sort of fade out a little bit I'm not too worried about getting the whole thing from point to point it's just a little clump of trees right here and and I think that's good again we move it around just a little bit Then we're gonna let that dry. Yeah, okay, then we'll let that dry and come back for the details. I think that'll work, kind of a nice contrast between the really, this blue and the light bright clouds and this little clump of, little clump of trees here. If, oh, I know, you know, one actually kind of fun. We could even put a silhouette. We've been talking about putting people into our, our images. So let's say I could put maybe a, well, maybe a little dark, the brown. Make I put just a little bit of somebody in the background, maybe. Maybe, maybe let's see, right about here someplace. Maybe there's somebody back here. There's his head. There's a little, little body kind of, there's like somebody back there. Oh, this looks like a girl with a dress. There, we'll let that, let that stand like that. And maybe we'll put another person here. Again, very light color, see that? As if somebody's right there. Just a little, kind of a little head there, shoulders, little torso. So it kind of looks like somebody back there. It's an impression of somebody standing there, back in the shadows. And that kind of works. Kind of fun. Okay, so we'll let this kind of like sort of a Where's Waldo kind of person way in the background there. So we'll let this dry. Like I said, we'll come back and uh, check out, uh, uh, as that dries, then we'll come back and just put a little, some dark details involved in this, so.